Hey Terry, it's Tracy. Um, I got to see your spook today and it's super lovely and I want you to see what I've seen in this picture that Terry drew. So, uh, hopefully we can convey everything to you and if not, well, at least we gave it a good try. I'll talk to you later. One of the first things I seen was the waves, and if you ever watch music uh, in a wave lab, it's very expressive, beautiful, and emotional. And that was the first thing that I seen in the artwork was the waves. They were absolutely stunning to me. Um, this blue line made me feel like I was watching you draw, just fluid, swift, very precise. It was like I was on a roller coaster, and it was amazing. And I know I've seen you draw the beast, and that's exactly what that line reminded me of. And it was absolutely wonderful to see it. It made me smile. If you look really super close, uh, the the waves are almost like a graffiti, and you can you can see your name your name. Here's the N A U G, kind of a little weird, but it can go for it. H, and then T O, and then the N. And if your name was ever in graffiti, that's exactly how I would envision that it would be. So it has a artistic classy urban feel to it, which I think is also a symbol of the talent that you have, which can really categorize and be crossed over any genre, any space, any time period. It's just well-rounded. In the picture, you can tell that at the beginning there are light shades and there are light shades at the end. And to me that represents the beginning of life when we didn't know as much and we were slowly learning to where the end of life that we still have unforeseen but the path is still clearly there and hopefully we'll be able to all travel the journey. What I see here is the double helix. I see the strand of life and it's flowing into your path. I hope you can see it. Because life is always something that continuously needs to be remembered. I see the path and I see the dark shades of where we've had really hard times in our lives but they're also surrounded by some of the lighter shades where there was still some good in our lives throughout the entire process. Um, there's even breaks throughout and that's okay because darkness can't be everywhere all the time. Um, super scary but you always seem to pull yourself out and right now everything's getting lighter towards the end. Towards the unknown part, everything's getting lighter. And with light, there's going to come a really wonderful, wonderful time. It's just waiting for you, bro. There's a few things left that I really want to point out as I 
there it is. Up here, you can tell the shades are different. And as they come down here, it's almost like fingers with fingernails. And they're holding and they're squeezing. But you can still see yourself. And if I had to guess, I'm going to say this is your mom in her little nightgown. I don't know if she has a blue one. Maybe, maybe not. She's in a little nightgown, her little face, her little figure, and some pink slippers. Little slip-on slippers. So, I think I can see your mom in there. She's just going right along with you. I want you to know that you also leave fingerprints on people. All the people that love you, that care about you, leave these. It's like their little happy trail. And the more fingerprints of a person, the more they care about you. Hopefully, you got the tour. And let's even flip it upside down. Let's see if you can see anything else in it. Because there's your heartbeat. 